Answer me. I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Yeah, I don't like Troy either. Yeah. Oh. Bill and Rebecca. This ain't gonna be pretty. We haven't seen Alvin yet. Okay, that's not a good sound. Rebecca! She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Now get in here. Oh no, Alvin. Oh no. Alvin? Alvin! He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. You're a bully. Come again. You're, You're just you a bully. heard me. I know it wasn't a fair fight. Yeah, I suppose it wasn't, but life ain't fair most of the time. Yeah, well you don't have to I add to it. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Psh, is that a threat? Psh. Now. You don't scare me, Carver. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. Hate to see what it's he does to people he doesn't like. sink in during times like this. Oh, wait, I have but seen he that. he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. Mm hmm And we can't have that around here. Mm -hmm. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. You have to be able to contribute. You're, You're a murderer. You can try and call it something else. But I know what it is. What it really is. Listen, Clementine. It ain't murder. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Oh, people like us. You understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I'm not like you. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. Mm -hmm. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. Yeah. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing if I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. It's not your baby. It's Alvin's. Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't Remote shut off. control, other... I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Ugh, Carver. So there's a walkie-talkie there. I feel like he's gonna notice if it's missing, though. Yeah, one long day indeed. Poor Reggie. I'm wondering if Reggie can. Because we all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. 
So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just got to figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is what? it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Kenny, do not speak to me like that. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. That's the plan I, I vote for. About Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If good. Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? There was a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. Mm -hmm. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Kenny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly we can do both. either. Luke's in no shape to help us. You want to put our fate in that guy's hands? Yeah, it's we can not do both. Happening. Why can't we do both? Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we get that turd radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. Sounds and then like a plan. Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's uh. not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. Nice. There First we go. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. <laughs> What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. Right. I can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Nope, it's true. Trust me, I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. You seem to know what you're talking about. This is nuts. No, it's not. It's perfect. Lee figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and... We walked right through. Really? Yep. Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. Oh, thank you, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. All right. Jack. Where she reminds... the hell did she come from? She reminds me of Jack from Mass Effect 2 and 3. We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then, just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Cool. Probably. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. So that's why Come Clementine on, has to up do and it. At him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. Now or never. That, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. She's fearless. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Lee raised Come her on, well. Kid. She's like, all right, let's do it. Before the adults chicken go. out. I got you. Before all the adults chicken out. Come on, Clem. You can do this. You don't have much to lose, girl. We can't stay here. You don't have much to lose. Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you not in your bunk, we're all done. 
Shit, he's coming back. Oh, great. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. <sighs> Oof. Climb, Clem. Just climb. We're in trouble. Yeah, there's a lot of walkers there. Just keep climbing. Who knows? Maybe Luke will spot you. It's now or never. All right, girl. Metal Gear Solid time. Man, you're not gonna believe what I'm looking at. There's gotta be two or three thousand of them out there. In the parking lot? No, not in the parking lot. I can't see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking up. So you're not sure? What, about how many there are? Yeah. How can I be? Fuck. I hope they pass by us. God, yeah. You think we're ready this time? Oh, there is Carver. Yeah, there's Carver. I don't Carver. know. Bill thinks we are. Of course he does. Still we in his the office. Same thing last time. We learned a lot since last time. Is it enough, though? We'll find out if they turn this way. Yeah. Yeah. Where is the guy? Trying not to be seen. I don't know where the other guy is. Uh, jeez, we're gonna get caught. We're gonna get caught. We're gonna get caught. Is he still up there? Okay. Let's just keep looking that way. I don't know what I should be doing. Keep looking at the... Look over the edge. Oh, this is where. <sighs> Poor Reggie. I feel bad. I still feel bad for him. I I knew I said we weren't gonna get him into trouble, and well, kind of didn't work out as well. I'm wondering if it's possible for him to survive that if I had helped. I wonder what would have happened if I did help Sarah. But. See. Clem, come on. Come on, Clem. Thank you. I'm like, I'm clicking, I'm clicking, really I am. Here we go. Click on. There's Tavia. Look at all those walkie-talkies. It's crazy about Reggie, huh? Yeah. You think Bill... Go on. Nah, it's just... I was wondering if you thought Bill maybe... Spit it out, Hank. I don't think Bill was gonna let him back in. Huh. You don't? No. Do you? I don't know. So really, no bullshit. You think we're ready? I think so. The homestead, at least. I'm not sure about the expansion. Mm. They're out there just moaning. That's what they do. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know what you mean. You figure we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. How did she not see that? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that why you're down there? Yep. What happened to it again? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people in. See, it's hard not to call them prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had the materials before we started expanding. That was too easy. There's got to be a catch. How is she not seeing us? I don't know how she's not seeing us. I, how in the world did she... Unless she chose not to see us. <sighs> We're so gonna get caught. Oh. Uh, we're so gonna get caught. 
You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. I don't have a choice. We best get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well? Come on, Clem. Don't keep us waiting. You guys seem worried. You kidding? I'm just about keeled over. <laughs> you little devil. <laughs> I'm really liking how I'm role-playing Clementine in this. <laughs> oh, Everybody snarky Clem. You are. No need draw on suspicion. That was so cool. Thank yep. you, Clem. No problem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. <laughs> Thanks, Jack. Thanks. Yep. Jane will remember that. Jane anyway, and Jack. Yeah. Get some rest. I don't know about this plan, guys, but I think I it's our best bet. Duck today, about his dumb little face. It's not very nice to say about your son. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Aww. The kid was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he'd just run. He couldn't stop him. Yeah. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. He was a good boy. I remember the good boy part. Well, not long day tomorrow. One long day. That's what I'm afraid of. All right, we're all here. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we... It's Tavia. Time she knows. Have... Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going. To work. Rebecca, Nick, Sarah, Jane. If you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, Troy's coming for the rest of you. Uh-oh. <clears throat> I don't know who that guy was. All right, look. If we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him, I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking kidding? I can do it. I got it. Me and Luke, we, we got it. No offense, but come on. That's crazy. She's a kid. Why would... There's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Exactly. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, I'm I'll trusting take it. her. I got He's it. He's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. She doesn't need your respect. Give me the radio. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. And don't think today's gonna be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's gonna be surveilling your ass every second of the day, you hear? Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. I heard you, okay? Good. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Thank get you, your Kenny. Get your tags all snagged on something. Thank you, Kenny. <laughs> Let's go! You have your pockets all out. That was the best Kenny could come up with, but it worked. I don't know why that worked, but somehow it did. <laughs> hey, she's with me? Oh, shit. I almost forgot. Yeah. Well, take her then. I don't care. Yeah. Wait, wait, what's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. Can't uh -oh. you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. What... what are we doing? Don't worry about it. Come on. Uh. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. I didn't believe you when you told me about Reggie. 
I ran and found Bill once I left you. Figured even if he had done it, he'd make up some sort of excuse, but Bill was just so matter-of-fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something, like it had to be done, and that was just one of those moments when your blood runs cold. Goose pimples up and down your arm, because it turns out the person you thought you knew was never there. You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? You could say that. You know you can talk to me, right? No, I don't really know that, Bonnie. Not I yet. I was dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on everything holy that'll never happen again. I... I need to talk to Kenny. Do you now? Yep. I can understand you're uncomfortable. I won't force you to be around me if you don't want to. Go on, back out, and be with Kenny. I, I don't... I'm sorry, Bonnie. I don't trust you yet. I, I, I don't. Like... I didn't want to tell her about Luke. That would have been dumb. You know... I didn't want to tell her that I trusted her because... I, I didn't really. And what's the use of me telling her, really, if I didn't really Y'all better trust hurry her. that shit up! I hate babysitting you assholes. Luke? Luke, please tell me you're here, Luke. Please tell me you're not dead. Luke, are you okay? Oh no, Luke got caught. Oh no, Luke got caught. Oh no! Oh no. Uh, let's not examine the bloodstain Luke. just yet. Where is he? I'm really afraid, guys. Luke, if you're hiding, come out. That looks really old. He's probably fine. I hope so. What do you think, Robin? Did you see him? Robin? Oh! I swear to Christ you're gonna regret this! I was... You ain't supposed to be out here! Oh, jeez. I'm wondering what happened to Luke. Oh my gosh. You people been here one fucking day and already you're fucking up! Well, you wait and see what happens. Move! Hey! I wonder where he is. Oh, now I'm worried. <gasps> Get over there. They caught him. And how is it that we're repaid for our trust? <sighs> Don't with you dare to hurt him. With deceit? With theft? Did you know about this? Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. It can't just run from your problems. It can't just up and leave when it gets tough. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Tough is all we got now. Get that through your fucking skulls. Why do you want it? Luke here, he can't help you now. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. Now you can start. By telling me where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio ain't in my hand by then, we'll have to make things more difficult. Ugh. One. Two. I found it. It's right here. I got it. Kenny. Oh, Kenny's taking it. It's all right. Oh my gosh, Kenny. I, I feel like Kenny's Sorry gonna that. die in this episode. Not sure what I was thinking. I feel like he's done for this episode. Three. Not because I want it to happen, but I just have this feeling that they'll bring him back just to kill him. <laughs> Fucker. Hey! No! God! <gasps> Jesus Christ! Stop! Stop <gasps> okay. Him. Somebody stop him! Troy, do Let something! Me go. Stop! Clementine! Help you me. have to do this, Bill! No! Stop! I'm helping it. Kenny. Kenny! Forget Kenny. this. Uh, Ow! Little shit. Excuse me! Bill! That's enough, Bill! Please! Bill, there's a breach! Alright, everyone come with me. Bonnie, you stick around. 
Make sure these folks don't get into any more trouble. Yeah. Okay. No supper for y'all tonight. Maybe an empty stomach will give you some perspective. I'll we'll try this again tomorrow. Excuse me? Oh, Carver. Do your best with him, Carlos. You need to get him able to move, because we're leaving tonight. Good. Good. We're leaving tonight. I really am excited to find out what would happen if the other four people came with Tapia. Uh, that gives me something to look forward oh. to in other people's Let's Plays. Dang it. To see some of the other... I'm, I'm assuming we're going to see other people here. Uh-oh. Is Kenny... What's going on with Kenny? Did he not make it? What happened to Kenny? What she No, said. really. She said she can get us out of the pen if we can get the PA system going. Second she hears it, she'll run over and spring us. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. I was hungry, I got reckless trying to steal some food, and I got caught. Why isn't it great? Because most of us are beat to shit, or pregnant. And besides that, it's risky as hell. 